All right, so here we are, MotormaniaTV.com, 2016 PDRA season, and we have Keith Haney. You know my name. Do I know your name, Keith Haney? I mean, you've been one to watch this season. You had the Enigma come out in the radio world. You shocked it there. What are you going to do here in the Schweitzer Dynamics presented by Motec Pro Nitrous? I'm going to do the exact same thing. I got a little something special for them. Uh, they didn't think we were going to do anything in the radio car, and we shocked them there. We're going to do the same thing here. We got a little grudge race on Friday night. That's going to be – Jay Cox is going to be – I got something special for him when it's all done and over. I know he's been testing. He hasn't been successful here. You think it's a little head game? You think he wants to get in Keith Haney's head and, and try to take that? Nah, not at all. I'm fixing to go up there and lay one down here in about uh, 20 minutes. I'll go up there and lay one down, and he'll, he'll be scratching his head the rest of the night. Now, are we going to know your name at the end of the season, uh, you know, 2016? You think you got a chance at that championship? I do, but it's not me. It's the guys on the crew, and it's notorious. Uh, you know, again, I'll say it 100 times. I let go of a button. You know, these chassis, the chassis guys and the tuners, you know, Brand, both I call them the, the double Bs, Brandon and Brandon, um, them two guys, they do all, you know, they get they get the car going down the track and the other guys do the work for, uh, you know, to make sure that it's all ready to go for me to go down the track. I have to drive a little bit. That's about it. Just you know, a little bit. Just a little bit, as long as I can keep it away from, like I did, a lights out. Yeah, we won't talk you know, about right, that. Right. I mean, yeah, yeah. But. You know, I come right back and did it again, though, didn't I? <laughs> Went a couple rounds. You did, you did, and then, then you, you, you fell asleep. But that's okay. We won't tell it. Yeah. Fell asleep at the wheel, sure enough. But, no, I'm looking forward to this year. You know, I'm glad they're here in Tulsa. I'm excited about the PDRA and how they 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 did a, they gave the right move. by made the call last week earlier in the week so that we didn't have all these racers here and the sportsmen. Now you got people that can park in the grass now here. I mean, everything is full. There isn't a spot open um, on the concrete. So and that fills uh, 160 cars or 50 cars, something like that. And then now they're going up the return roads and up on there. So pretty excited about that. And I'm sure there's more coming. So, I mean, it's already full. There ain't a place to park. So you got to make sure you want to be here. 2016 Tulsa Raceway Park. Of course, uh, don't forget the Nitrous Wars. You know, I, I hear about that. Flat Out Gaskets has brought on a sponsorship. And you're like in the center of it. Well, you know, I'm, I'm excited to see Flat Out Gaskets come aboard. You know, I think it's a great thing. But, you know, the biggest thing is I'm going to drag Dre the whole dang weekend. You know, I think Stevie's here, too. He's on my list. Travis is on my list. He's going to go right on down. I, I, Franklin's on my list. It don't matter. Hey, when we go, when we line up next to each other sitting on that starting line, we're, we're all not friends then. When we get it's on at the at the finish line, some when usually you're not friends at the finish line either. Everybody can say they get out and hug each other. That's bull crap. You basically keep your mouth shut because you're liable to get whooped for winning, and whoop if you get, if I lost. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. It ain't quite that bad. But you know, uh, I just I'm ready. I'm ready to I'm ready to roll it up. I'm I wasn't I wasn't a contender last year. Till the end of the year. Till the end of the year. And now it's time. I'm starting. I ain't changed hardly anything. It's the wrap. I think notorious, man. That thing's going to come alive. We're fixing to be notorious this weekend. I promise you. So there you have it. Flat out gas. It's Nitrous Wars. It's going to be year of the Nitrous cars here to 2016 PDRA season. Uh-oh. Here comes your buddy. Your buddy and my pal. Yes, sir. The one and only notorious under pressure. The man himself, and I just met his little boy up here. He's a nice kid. He is a good He kid. says he can now talk his daddy. I feel sorry for him, though. Yeah, he's going to be a victim at one point in time. I'm afraid. Right. right. I hope they don't take out on that kid what uh -uh. they want to take out on him. Uh-uh. You don't want to be in that road. So Keith Haney coming to you from Broken Arrow, Oklahoma, 44 years of age. Seven car dealerships under his tutelage. Nine. He's up to nine now. Billy Albert power plant in the left-hand lane. Rick Jones built race car. And I'm telling you what, Scott Blake had a little bad luck here yesterday. Let me just tell you what a good guy Keith Haney is. Keith loaned uh, Scott Blake a brand new Mark Mickey transmission so Scott can make this race. And he doesn't live in Canada. He don't know Scott Blake, but he loaned a brand new Mark Mickey 400 to put in this car in the left lane, and they're running each other first round. That's what you call a family. That's what you call drag racing. That. Right here at the PDRA, we are a prime example of just that. So Keith Haney backing it on up. He's got the support of Schweitzer Dynamics. Brandon Schweitzer, a great group of folks here. Brandon Pez on the chassis. They have all the potential 
to do a record setting run. Larry Jeffers race cars on board. And for Blake, we saw this come out. This car came out of Rockingham 2 last year with a brand new package. And, uh, you know, Billy Albert knows how to set a car up. He's standing right behind the car. The purge of the nitrous there. And we are going to see us a pair. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to predict that uh, Keith Haynes is going to run an 82. I don't know why I got 82 on the mind, but I'm going to say 82. Now, he went quicker than that yesterday, but I, I'm just going to guess he's going to try to get him an A to B pass. Now, we are talking about Keith Haney. I just probably shouldn't have thought that way. <laughs> this is all or nothing. You know he's going to swing for the fence. That's the only way he knows. If you got nine car dealerships, are you going to hang around and wait for something to happen, or are you going to make it happen? You're going to make it happen. There you go. Trust me, buddy. That's what they say in the car business. One owner and trust me, buddy. <laughs> you don't know nothing about car business, do you? I've been known to sell a few in my day. Always have people say, man, you can't trust them to use car dealers. Like I've been one my whole life. Uh, I've seen the picture. I know it's true. going to go 3.976 at 183 miles an hour. So for Haney, had to pedal the car, goes 534 with a 6 at just 98.93 miles an hour. Yeah, uh, he, uh, Scott Blake had a 947, 60 foot, a little lazy at 330, 263, but uh, Haney, he was swinging with a fence. You were right. Uh -huh. Now, speaking of uh, you-know-who, uh -huh. left lane, Red Morrison, powered. The man himself, Keith Hayes. In camp down in North Carolina. The new Corvette built by Robert Hayes. And uh, I think this is a Larry Jeffers Camaro in the left-hand lane. Keith, what do you think there, Carl? That is correct, my sir. All dealerships, all the time. I'm gonna, you say he's got nine of them. That's nine. right. This is Keith Haney from Broken Arrow, Oklahoma. Larry Jeffers race cars, we're in Morrison. He's got Brandon Pez on the tune. Brandon Schweitzer with the Nitrous Kid. He's got all the best of the best. Hey, one thing, him and Jason, this ought to be a good run. Both of them want to uh, turn the wind light on. You know, it's bragging rights. You know, oh, yeah. You don't ever want to look at the back of anybody's race no. car. Beautiful red, beautiful red Corvette painted by Terry Davis out of Whitfieldville. Thank you, Terry. Uh, Right, built this car in 90 days, and uh, it's been out here. We've had a little issues from time to time. It's not been the car. It's just been bugs biting us. Hey, I'd rather get bit in February and March than in June and July. Yeah, because we've all know what that feels like. It ain't no fun right. to get out there in the middle of here, the points championship. Yep. Here's rear Morrison left lane. Billy out of right lane. Let's see what happens. with a six at 200 and point zero five miles an hour these two guys have talked more trash than the city dump can cover up but we're about to see what happened keith haney in the notorious chevrolet camaro and swinging for the fences the ex-baseball player jay cox in the mouth of the south bright mariner behind him in the charlie buck powered camaro in the left lane the crower lane they won't tell me how much money it's for, but Keith said if he wins and he stands on his wallet, he'll be six inches taller. So I don't know how much money that is. But we're about to find out who's got the baddest nitrous car, East versus West. Haney from right here in Broken Arrow, Oklahoma. Jay Cox, Dundraluggy here. Oh, my gosh, look at the sign. Tulsa's finest. Oh, man, look at here. They got a little surprise for him. I tell you what, it's going down right here like flat tires. They have fired him up. You guys get on your feet. You're about to see something worth watching right here. Here comes Notorious Keith Haney. <laughs> Here we go. 
for you. That Brian, he's out of control right now. Don, tell us what's going to go on here. Who do you think is going to take her, buddy? Is it going to be Keith Haney or is it going to be Jay Cox? <laughs> These guys are wild. So a big purge of the nitrous for Haney. Rear Morrison Power, right side. Charlie Buck racing engines under the hood for Jay Cox. My God, anybody in a rush? I don't think so. So, take her, Don. Quarterback top end zone, and here we go. We got Jay Cox, Keith Haney. It was the big match, and Jay Cox takes it. What do you think about that? Look at a pumpkin oh, shirt, baby. Man. That's when you got it together when you buy shirts. You know, what? <laughs> you know what he ain't got together is that motor after that pass right there. I was smart enough to hit the or not hit the wall. He wasn't smart enough to lift. Uh, he put double or nothing. No, he put the voodoo double on me. Let's go. We're, we're doubling, doubling up. Let's I get it on. That, that's right. They say Keith, you were scared of him. You were driving over towards had, the wall. I had no steering wheel. <laughs> it was in the air the whole time. Who got who on the tree? Oh, that's what it's all about. Oh! <laughs> so there you have it. Pro Nitro Center Front 2016. Switzer Dynamics for Senate Motec. Wow. Okay, Keith Haney, notorious Switzer Dynamics in the left lane, motor in the car, rear marsh, and on right hand side, Billy Albert. Brad, I know you're watching, buddy. Cross your fingers, because uh, it's like Paul said, we want to be laughing, not crying. So uh, we, they've been struggling all weekend, and uh, you know, new car, new car blues. Keith, he's unfortunately he struggled a little bit the other night when he got smashed by the pumpkin. So uh, I know that hurt, that would hurt me. I probably would never get over it. So I'm glad I'm not the one who set that deal up. Well, I think he set it up. He's his own worst enemy. Ashley, can you go to <clears throat> So for Keith Haney, the car dealer here from Broken, Oklahoma, Broken Arrow, Oklahoma. Okay. Well, I'm going to be broken in a minute. 44 years of age, owns nine car dealerships, or is in partnerships in nine dealerships at the very least. I can list them all, but there's too many. Suburban, Miami, I'm, I'm, Nissan, they got them all. He's the wash boy. He's the he, he does all yeah, the car yeah. prep, the new car yeah, prep. Yeah. That's right. That's what I heard. Got a pretty fancy office, though, for the new car prep guy. They wanted to make him look good. They could. <laughs> hard so. to, it's hard to dress up a pig, you know what oh, I mean? Oh. I'll tell you what. I'm glad you're on tape saying that, not me. Jason Harris from Pittsburgh, North Carolina. The Warbird 2, as Dad says. So far, it's been a dead chicken, so let's see if we get this thing going. <laughs> we got All right, we'll get it figured out. Everybody knows that they ain't going to quit. No Jim chance Jim Boone says gonna it's going to run. You see him with his towel? He's ready. He's hanging. He's, he's going to spend the day just for Willie Bars. I know he hear me in the car. Probably got his radio on, on FM. Brendan Pez, car chief for Keith Haney, backs away from the wheelie bars, and they're going to let him go. There goes the Warbird. She's going to put a number up there. How about a 382 with a 5 at 199.73 miles an hour? And I see a big sense of relief coming over the right-hand lane. Billy Albert and Jimmy Boone and the fellas there, Robert Hayes. All right, here we go in Schweitzer Dynamic Pro Nitrous presented by Motec. First round, Keith Haney, the man right here from Oklahoma. This is his track, left in lane, the 2014 Pro Nitrous World Champion from Pittsburgh, North Carolina, Jason Harris. So here we go, Schweitzer Dynamics Pro Nitrous, round number one. It's going to be number eight against number seven. 36 years of age is Jason Harris, Jimmy Boone, the car owner and team support member. He's the best cook in the house. But we, that's what we hear. Diamond racing pistons on the Racing engines on the For Keith Haney, we're talking about Rear Morrison.
Larson, Brandon Schweitzer, and Brandon Pez all on board the crew here. If this guy don't have enough knowledge and wisdom in that team, I feel sorry for him. Well, I tell you, he's already been whooped by one North Carolina guy this weekend, so I'm sure he's up for bear. I mean, Jason's going to have his hands full now because Jason's been struggling with the car, you know, trying to work out the new bugs and everything out of this brand-new car. But Keith Haney, that car's fast. Rear Morrison power on the hood, Billy Al power under Jason's car. Both of them good drivers and both kind of hyper and motivated. So Robert Hayes and Jimmy Boone and Brad Boone. Brad Boone, cross your fingers over there. I know you're home watching. And Pauline, let's see what happens. Let's see if we can pull this North Carolina car out. Well, you know what? Number seven versus number eight. The ever so slight advantage going to the car in the right-hand lane. But you know what? It's time to put up or shut up like Don says. It all becomes very even at this moment because anything can happen in drag racing. So Frankie Taylor looking on as an interested party with Keith Haney and a whole group of folks over there on the right-hand side. And we got our normal bunch over here with the, the Boone team. That's Robert Hayes and car builder Jamie. And who's your tires on board left-hand side? Diamond Pistons in the engine. Let's not forget about our folks from Drag 965 helping out. And this is the Warbird 2. All right, Chase is ready, and Haney's coming. Sometime. Eventually. All right, Haney's out there. Chase is right there with him. How about 050 on the tree? Jason goes 379 with a 6. 199 for speed by a victory of 25 thousandths of a second. Hey. It goes to Jason Harris. North Carolina has beat Keith Haney two times in Oklahoma. Let me hear it out there, fans. Woo. Hey, that's something else out there. All right, so Keith Haney done for the weekend. Jason Harris finding his mojo. 